name is Lani, Ava Rodriguez. I'm six years old. Today, I'm going to show you how to subtract fractions by following with an uncommon denominator step by step the easiest way. Even a six-year-old can do it. Subtracting fractions by following with uncommon denominators. 68 and 212 minus 47 and one-third equals. First, we're going to look at the denominator. 12 and 3. 12 and 3 are uncommon. To find a common denominator of 12 and 3, we're going to use the LCD. LCD. You know what LCD means? L means for least, C is for common, D is for denominator. To find the LCD of 12 and 3, we're going to use the multiples of 12 and 3. The multiples of 12 are 12, 24, 36, 48. So on and so forth. The multiples of 3 are 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. So on and so forth. We're going to use circle our least common multiples. 12 and 12. 12 is our LCD. We're going to change the denominator into 12. But first, we're going to write the whole numbers. 68 and 12 minus 47 and 12 equals. Since our denominator is the same, we're going to find equivalent fractions. To find equivalent fractions, we're going to divide the denominator and multiply it in the numerator. 12 divided by 3 equals 4. 4 times 1 equals 4. The same thing with 12. 12 divided by 12 equals 1. 1 times 2 equals 2. going to subtract our fractions. You can only subtract the numerator and you can bring down the denominator. 2 minus 4 equals cannot be. How oh, one from 68? 60. 68 becomes 67. The one that we borrow from 68 becomes 12, 12. Why do we use 12, 12? Why not 11, 11? Or 4, 4? Or 8, 8? We use 12, 12 because our denominators are 12. We're going to rewrite our fractions except for numerator 2. 67 and 12 minus 47 and 4, 12 equals To find the missing numerator of over here, we're going to add numerator 12 to numerator 2. Twelve plus two equals fourteen. Finally, we can subtract the fractions. You can only subtract the numerator and you can bring them by denominator. Fourteen minus four equals ten. Bring down denominator twelve. Seven minus seven equals zero. Six minus four equals equals 2. 10 12 is not the learner's term. So to reduce 10 12, we're going to divide the numerator and the denominator by using the GCF. GCF. Do you know what GCF means? G means for greatest, C is for common, and F is for factor. To find the GCF of 10 and 12, we're going to use the pair of factors of 10 and 12. The pair of factors of 10 are 1 times 10 two time, and 2 times 5. We're going to write down our factors from least to greatest. 1, 2, 5, and 10. The 
pair of factors of 12 are 12. Oh, sorry. One times 12. Oh no. One times 12. Two times six. And three times four. I'm going to write down our factors from least to greatest. One, two, three, four, six, and twelve. I'm going to circle on our common factors. One and two. Two is our GCF. We're going to divide 10, 12 by 2. Ten divided by two equals five. Twelve divided by two equals six. Twenty and fifth six is our final answer. And that is how you subtract fractions of borrowing with an uncommon denominator the easiest way. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel. Bye. Boing.